Hi Naptime friends, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. If this is your first time watching, don't forget to subscribe. I want to thank you guys so much for watching my videos. I'm almost at 200 subscribers. I'm so, so excited. Today we're going to be doing some resin art and it's going to be over these two acrylic pores right here. I wasn't too happy with them. The paint dried with some texture. So I'm going in with my Pro Marine resin and I'm going to be using all artisan pigments today. I'll, um, you can get those on Amazon and I'll link them down below. So with my Pro Marine, I just did six ounces of my part A, six ounces of my part B, stirred it up for three minutes and now I'm going to put it in my little cups here and mix up all my mica powders. This is my Stone Coat Countertops white base tint. I keep it in this hydrogen peroxide bottle. I find it um, is easier to you know, dispense out and it stores easier than the stone coat packaging. So I would say for about three ounces, I used in about an eighth of a teaspoon and I wasn't going for a lot of cells on this piece. So I didn't add a ton of the base tint. Um, you'll see when I put it down, it's a little bit transparent. You want yours to be opaque if you're looking for cells. So I just went in with a little bit of clear that was left over in my cup and smoothed that out over both pieces. Now I'm going to go in with my white base tint and spread that all around with my gloved hand. And then after that, I'm going to add all my mica powders. So um, you'll see how it turns out. I hope you guys enjoy watching. I am going to put some music in the background and then just hop on if I feel like I need to tell you anything.
was really liking the jellyfish and I got scared that they were going to move. So I decided to take my popsicle stick and run it through everything on the piece. I just ran it back and forth, kind of zigzag, and it ended up turning out really nice. I really want to uh, redo these jellyfish, but maybe in kind of like a blue silver tone piece. So now I'm going to go in with some crushed glass and I just got this at my local Michaels. Um, I think it was like $3 for a big bag of it. Not too bad, but you have to be careful because um, the glass is sharp. So I just sprinkled that in a line going across both the pieces, try to make them kind of look a little bit more alike, even though they look a lot alike already. And then I put a little bit of my titanium resin over the top of the glass just to make sure it was set in place. Hit it with my heat gun one more time to pop any bubbles and I'm going to let this sit overnight. So here we are. It's about 18 hours later and the piece didn't move very much. So that was good. I probably could have left my jellyfish, but that's okay. It was a fun uh, learning experience. I'd never made jellyfish before. So now I kind of know what to expect with the spray paint and the clear resin, but I really like how this turned out. When I took the popsicle stick, it kind of, the, the spray paint really made it have some cool effects. And it's very sparkly. I know you can kind of see, but the titanium, whew, that's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful color. And it sits right on top too, so it doesn't um, sink to the bottom and get lost. So what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. This piece reminds me of a sunset. I think I'm going to put these ones in my bathroom. What color should I do next? I'm really feeling warm tones. I love, love, love red, but I just don't use it a lot. So I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. I appreciate each and every one of you so, so much for taking the time out of your day to hang out with me for a little while and watch me do some resin art. I will see you guys on Wednesday for another video. And if you're not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. It helps my channel and um, helps me reach my goal. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers, but I am so, so thankful for my almost 200 that I have right now. You guys rock. See you later. Hope you're having a great day. Bye.